I am an italic rep now. Activity, lifestyle, bullet journal videos, and vlogs. So if you want to hit subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. Welcome to a couple days in my life. I don't know if I'm gonna make this a whole entire work week vlog because today is Tuesday. But you know, you guys, I was just having a chill Monday. I feel like I have a lot of stuff that I like can't forget to catch you guys up on this week. But ever since I cut back on my upload schedule, I just I've been feeling really good about like giving myself more time to do the things that I felt like I couldn't do before because I was uploading three times a week. I was thinking like right before I went to bed, I was like, I should start. I was like, I could start a vlog right now but I kind of just had that like personal day to myself and it was so nice it was so so nice so forgive me but today's Tuesday we're gonna start off the vlog today ever since I took off my dip manicure for my birthday like my nails have just been like an absolute mess like this has already broken these have already broken like I'm just it's so hard getting your nails done because I don't want to get them done every single time because I know that it kills my nails, but I just, I swear, like, I get it once and it kills my nails. <laughs> Pre-workout sink in. Alani New is having, and Women's Best, they're both having their Black Friday sales. They start on the 19th, whatever day that is, but I need to get pre-workout because I have, like, half a scoop left. Like, I tried giving myself a whole scoop and I couldn't, which means I need to, like, just dump it all out. Today is week three, day two of a live strong 2.0. I was behind last week, so I finished up week two last week, and then I had only like two days left of my workout week. So I just did cardio for both those days. So we're starting a whole new week this week, and it's almost seven o'clock. Obviously, I'm still waking up. Time to go to the gym, but happy Tuesday, happy work days. We're going to the office today too, so I'm happy to bring you guys along this week. Let's go to the gym. I'm worried that I'll be a fucking joke. I'm worried that I don't have control. Don't worry, baby, don't worry. Go and get some sleep while you always in a hurry. You got bigger things planned for you, don't worry. You ain't gotta come to conclusions this early. Don't worry, baby, don't worry. Go and get some sleep while you always in a hurry. You got bigger things planned looks like this and feels like this it's just it is just unbelievable <laughs> I just will tell you every single day until you get a Dyson air wrap that it is just so worth it from somebody that struggles a lot with like frizzy and coarse hair like this thing has actually just changed my life I am of course running and rushing to the office, at least I already packed everything. I just have to like get ready, which you guys know is the bare minimum. I posted this on my private Instagram story. <laughs> 
But I'm just gonna tell you guys, I don't want this to alarm anybody, but I am developing another bald spot. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever told you guys about that before, but I have like stress-induced alopecia. I went to a doctor about it in high school and um, and yeah, that's what they said. I have this cream that will help like boost the hair growth, but I think it's actually already growing back. I just like found it a little bit later. But like if I have my hair up, you can kind of see like where the bald spot was. <gasps> Good thing I have such thick hair that if I just part my hair in a different way, then you can't really notice it. But that's happening. <laughs> So yeah, it's it's all fine. I probably get bald spots like literally maybe once a year if it's really that bad. Honestly, ever since I changed my upload schedule, I have been sleeping a lot more. So I don't think that this is very alarming. I think I just kind of found it after the fact and it's fine. I will talk to you guys after work. But here's the work outfit today. This sweater is an old one that I got on sale from Topshop. I'm wearing all my usual jewelry. I'm gonna actually put on these new earrings that my sister gave me from, whoa, from her small business, Just Mindful. I think they're so cute. And she actually gave me a discount code for you guys. If you want to support a small women-owned, Asian-owned business, where every single piece that you buy from Just Mindful is a one of a kind. So like what you see on the website is what you'll get, which I think is really cool to help combat the negative stigma of mental health. And just like, look at how cute these are. Oh my God, excuse my pimple. <laughs> so cute. Okay guys, I am running out the door now, but I thought I'd show you my outfit because I think this outfit is so, so cute. I brought my winter coat from Princess Polly back from home. This was a birthday gift last year from my cousins, and I just think it's like, it's literally my favorite jacket ever to wear when it's cold out. And just like, look at this outfit, it's so cute. Sweater is old from Topshop. My earrings are just mindful. My jeans are from Abercrombie, and then my booties are from Topshop. I'm in a rush, of course, but I'll talk to you guys after work. What a nice morning we spent together. We don't make the rules, we found holes instead. I told you not to fall so deep. 18 feet going under now. It's a shock, but still alive. Thought we'd die the first round. Okay, hi guys. Oh my god. First of all. Let me just put everything down. I'm getting ahead of myself, but it's 9 p.m. <laughs> I forgot to tell you guys, but today was a going away happy hour for one of our team members who just moved on to a new company. So I ended up having dinner there. I completely forgot that I even had that. So it's a little sad because it's already dark and I have to wait until tomorrow morning because I really, really want to film this unboxing. But you guys, <laughs> this is my Apple Watch. You guys, I got this like a month ago and it's been over a month since I could get this and I'm so, oh my God, it's like taking everything in me not to, not to open it right now, but I really wanna unbox it with you guys and make like a whole video out of it. So that will be tomorrow. I'm honestly gonna go to sleep because I really wanna sleep early, wake up really early, get a good workout in and film this unboxing before going into the office because I am going into the office tomorrow and Thursday. So three days this week, which is kind of crazy. But I got a lot done today at the office. And if my friends are in the office, then like I am more inclined to wanna go. So that's what's going on right now. Also, another thing that happened today during work. Oh my God, you guys. I am an italic rep now, which is literally crazy. If you guys watched my vlog where I unboxed this special gift from Kiva Brent or DIY with KB, who literally helped me design this whole entire apartment, um, she sent me a welcome gift. I'll link that vlog for you guys, but she sent me a welcome gift of italic pure linen sheets. And oh my God, you guys, I've been like converted to linen. Linen is so so, so nice. And you have to get 100% linen, okay? But the really cool thing about Italic is that they partner with the same manufacturers as luxury brands. So, so for example, Italic's linen sheets, I think, I don't even know how much they are. Maybe they're like in between 70 to $80. I'm not exactly sure how much the linen sheets are, but I will just put the price comparisons here. They work with the same manufacturer as Brook Linen, I'm pretty sure. And just, again, I'll put the prices for you guys here, but basically like, oh my God, Italic is just so cool. Thomas has a membership, we share that. And so I bought some clothes from them a while ago and, and 
they reached out to me to be a rep and I'm so, so excited. I can't wait to show you guys like all the things that I'm getting from them. And I just wanna, I really, really like this brand just because I feel like, listen, I like nice things, but if I don't have to pay that much and it's like just as high quality, I kind of would obviously wanna do that more. So, so yeah, now I have a discount code for you guys. So if you use the code Jenna30, then you can get $30 off your first order of over $100, which means that's, basically 30% off of your first order. And yeah, I'll link that below for you guys too. That was exciting that happened at work today. I can't believe that I'm an italic rep. I like the brand is so cool. And I'm just really happy to share those products and that brand and a little discount for you guys. Not sponsored or anything. It's just, this is like what it's like to be a rep. So you can have like sponsored posts or you can just be a long-term rep, which is something that I like to do more because I like to work with brands that I actually use all the time. And yeah, okay, well, that was my day. Work was great, I wanna go to sleep. So, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. I'll show you guys a little bit of like my night routine when I do get a good night routine in. It's only 9 p.m. like I said, so lots of speaking, time to wind down and go to sleep early. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Definitely have a lot of footage for Monday. I always do this. I just really miss you guys. So I always vlog a lot on the first day of the week just cause like I wanna talk to you guys a lot. So, okay, let's get ready for sleep. rush to the gym <laughs> and honestly I feel like I'm not gonna have that much content today for you guys because I have a really busy day today I'm going to the office at eight o'clock my friend Andrew is picking me up because we're going shopping after work today <laughs> I think it'll be really fun I really want to go shopping and um and he like needed things to buy so he was like let's go shopping and I'm like okay so we're gonna go shopping after work today so I feel like I won't see you guys until like 8 or 9. I don't even know. But we are on a kick with the workout week today. I'm going to do a live strong week 3, day 4, because day 3 was a rest day. But my rest days will be a little later on. It says day 3 was a rest day, so like I should be resting today. But I'll be resting probably tomorrow and Friday. And then I'll do a pull day on Saturday or something like that. So... I don't know, but I like to I like to kind of get my workout week in early during the work week while I'm still feeling productive. One huge reason that I decided to cut back my upload schedule was so that I really could have more energy to exercise more because I felt like I wasn't doing that. Yeah, I'm really happy to finally get my exercise back in and a good routine. And yeah, it just feels nice. Okay. I know for a fact I will be rushing after the gym to get ready because I have to leave a little earlier today. So I'll show you guys my outfit right before I leave. But that will be it. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day, middle of the work week. Yes. Okay, guys, I'm headed out the door now. I even have a little bit of time to spare. I can't believe I'm early. If I know I'm on someone else's clock, then I will be sure to be on time. But I really wanted to show you guys my outfit because I really, really love it today. I think this is a really cute outfit. <laughs> Okay, so this long sleeve top is from Abercrombie. I got this during a sale last year and I think I got it for like $20 and it's really, really nice and thick. And then I'm wearing my new corduroy 
Urban Outfitters mom jeans that I hauled for you guys and then I'm wearing my same Topshop booties and this jacket is a beautiful, beautiful investment piece from Aritzia. I hate to say that I just think Aritzia is so amazing which like I don't even understand because I know how expensive Aritzia is but I just, I swear anything I try on is just perfect. <laughs> So this is their like lightweight trench coat and I wanted to wear something that was still a jacket but when I'm shopping like I can just still wear this inside. So, so here's my outfit today. I think this is so cute. What a fall look, right? I will talk to you guys after work or maybe I'll get a couple of clips during the mall. I don't know, we'll see. But happy Wednesday. I hope you guys have a good day and I'll see you guys after work. All the stuff you got, just hold up the bags. I only got two things. Yeah, but it doesn't look, it looks like two full bags. Nice. Two bags. <laughs> shopping. Hi guys, it is like 11 o'clock right now. Oh my God, it's 11.40, I need to go to sleep. But I got back from the mall. I got like a quick clip of Andrew with his clothes <laughs> while we went shopping and it was so much fun. Um, I just love shopping, especially like for other people. I just had like the best time ever. Like we both got off work pretty late today. We ended up leaving the office at like seven. So we were at the mall for like two hours and then we got pizza at Ann Pizza and then I came home and then like by the time I got home, it was around 9.30 or 10. And then as soon as I got home, I called Thomas to like talk to him and just like hang out with him and catch up with him. And now I'm reading and it's time to go to sleep. <laughs> I had a really good day, honestly. I am so productive this week being in the office. I was talking to Andrew about it. We kind of feel like almost a little bit better mentally because we've been going into the office. It's just really easy to separate like your work brain and your life brain. So I don't know, this week I like go back and forth a lot. Sometimes I go into the office once and weeks like this, I'm going into the office tomorrow too, to just like finish stuff up. I have some deadlines that I need to handle because I have all of next week off. So I just kind of want to make sure that I'm like doing everything in a good environment and getting everything done. So I'm going into the office again tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to go to the gym tomorrow morning for work because I kind of want to edit a little bit and give myself like a slow morning, especially because it's like already almost midnight. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get up at six. So we'll see how I feel, honestly, but if not, I'm just going to edit the silent unboxing that I filmed this morning because I unboxed my Apple Watch and it was so much fun. I love just like switching up my stuff and my last unboxing was like very chatty and me just like being way too excited. And this one was silent, ASMR, aesthetic, chill. So I'm excited to edit that. I don't think it'll take too long, hopefully. I honestly had a really good day. I hung out with my friends and talked to Thomas. If you guys were curious, all of my guy friends, Thomas knows them and like has hung out with them, met them in person and everything. So I don't know if anyone would like think anything weird about there's first of all, there's nothing weird with being friends with a guy if you're a girl or a girl if you're a guy and you're in a relationship. As long as like you have that mutual love and respect for each other, then there's really no issue. So Thomas knows Andrew, Andrew knows Thomas. And so all of my guy friends know Thomas and I don't know. I feel like I had to disclaim that. So I'm gonna go to sleep. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna, it'll just have to be another quick clip of me, whatever I do in the morning. And then I'll show you guys my outfit, of course. You guys have been requesting a lot more like office outfit of the days and stuff. So this is a very office outfit heavy week because I'm going into the office three times and yeah. I'll link everything, of course, that I can find, and if not, I'll link something very similar. But I'm happy that you guys like my work outfits. I try to keep them very neutral and very comfortable, but still me. So I just wanted to talk to you guys. I'm sorry I didn't talk to you guys like all day, but that's just the work week, especially work week in the office. Well, that is everything. I'm gonna go to sleep. I'm really tired. I took some melatonin, so like I'm starting to feel it. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. I hope you guys had a really good day and good night. Happy Thursday. I decided <laughs> to not go to the gym this morning and just give myself a nice, quiet, slow 
morning routine without going to the gym. I'm editing my Apple iWatch unboxing. And I'm sure you guys are wondering like, why are you still using your iPad if you got a new MacBook? But I, I forgot to update you guys on that. I'm waiting until my Thanksgiving break, which starts on Friday. It starts at the end of the day tomorrow. I took a whole week off for Thanksgiving and I feel like I just need to, I feel like I just need to have a lot of patience and a lot of extra time to learn Final Cut Pro. A part of me is like kind of scared to learn this new editing software just because I have no idea how to use it and I need to like learn how to use it. I'm sure it'll be easier than I think, but I like don't want to feel stressed or anything about learning how to use it and I just want to have that extra time. So I'm devoting all of next week to learning how to use Final Cut Pro. Okay, since this isn't an unboxing video, I can like go into more detail about this beautiful watch, but it's so nice. Does anyone else put on their watches just like this? Okay, so I'm wearing right now the Casetify black leather band as kind of like this is the band that I'll wear during work. But let me just show you guys. This is, it's so beautiful. This is what the Casetify gold watch band looks like. And you can just see that there's a difference between the starlight color and the gold color. So, the, I mean, I love how the starlight color looks. It's like this beautiful champagne, but I think I guess like manufacturers of other companies are having a hard time mimicking this color or something. I don't know, but let me know what you guys think. Does it look too weird that it's two different tones or do you think it looks fine? Either way, I think this is so pretty. I think I'm just gonna have to deal with the fact that they're different tones, but here's what the watch looks like. I think it's literally so pretty. I'm just so happy to have an Apple watch again. Oh my God. Oh my God. It is around 7.17 and I don't have to leave for the office until like 8.30. So I have a good hour or so to just be here and chill. I made some burdock tea. If you guys don't know, that is dried up burdock root. My mom makes that for me so that I can make my own burdock tea and it's really good for like your blood and digestive health. So that's my morning this morning. Slow morning. I feel proud. I worked out like my goal because I'm trying to work out three to four times a week if you guys watched my last work from home vlog. And I did that. I worked, th I worked out three times. And so I'm going to work out maybe like tomorrow or Saturday or Sunday, but whichever one it is, I'm just going to chill otherwise. Edit a video. And so yeah, good morning. That's the plan for this morning. I will talk to you guys before I go to work, but slow morning. the office here's my quick little outfit of the day very very simple this is an old oversized sweater from urban outfitters i think i got this in college maybe like three or four years ago but this is like actually one of my favorite sweaters ever it's a mock neck which is really nice it's oversized so i can wear it with jeans and this color is also really nice because you can wear it with black jeans or blue jeans so i really like that these mom jeans are from Abercrombie. I'm wearing my Doc Martens today just because I honestly don't have any meetings. Like like I said, my team is fully remote and barely anybody goes into the office anyways. So I'm just wearing my Docs today. And then I'm wearing my new Just Mindful earrings that my sister gave me. Yay, okay, let's go to the office. I think it's actually supposed to be pretty warm today. We'll see. Also, Thomas is coming after work today too, so you guys will see him. And we're gonna work from home on Friday. I'm going into the office a lot this week just because I have a lot to get done. But Lisa, look cute. <laughs> Happy end of Thursday. Oh my God. It's Thursday. I can't believe it's Thursday. I made my thumbnail for tomorrow's bonus video. It's, it's literally like four minute video, but I really wanted to do like a silent unboxing. So here's what the thumbnail looks like. Do you guys like it? I like it. I think it's really cool. Today was a really good work day. I came back after dinner because I ended up getting dinner with um, an old 
boss of mine from my old job position so it was really really nice I feel I'm honestly really sorry this is a really chatty work week vlog I feel like I'm not really showing you guys like kind of anything different throughout the week but I'm really gonna have to title this like repetitive work week in my life that's what we're gonna call this guys even my friends that do work week vlogs like they try to do something different at least or for me this week I'm literally just doing the same thing every day I'm just spending time with people this week because I've been able to get the extra sleep from having my videos already done. So that's kind of where I'm at right now. It's literally 1030 right now. I called Thomas when I came back and then I've just been kind of hanging out. Now it's time for sleep, but at least I got my stuff done and the video is already, I can't wait for you guys to see it. It'll be like a cute little small bonus video. And I got a lot of compliments on this sweater. I always get compliments on this sweater. I love it. It's so old, so I don't think you can get it anymore. But isn't it just really cute? thinking about this vlog and and definitely I feel like this is on the more boring side but you guys I feel like I always have to like disclaim this and I know that you guys know this but my vlogs are literally just my life that week and I think after Thanksgiving break I'll be able to like get in the holiday spirit more but like just being ahead on videos the whole week I just wanted to like be around my friends and be around people also, we did not work out this morning. I woke up at 6.30 and usually I can get out of bed after six hours, but I was like, absolutely not. So I slept in a little bit more, got out of bed at 7.30, did some yoga and stretching at around eight, and then I ordered new contacts and prepped my video, the bonus video. It's literally only four minutes, so there's that. Let's at least get started with our work day. At least we're gonna end the work week together and yeah. been going nowhere lately it's time to start all over i'm walking just a little bit i'm gonna exercise either literally at 10 o'clock or at six we'll see i have a team lunch with my team today so we're all just like gonna get on zoom and talk to each other and hang out i'm gonna work on my goals in the afternoon and just basically do all of my meetings and project work and stuff before that so i can finish off kind of my friday doing goals that's my for today i will talk to you guys at around lunch or something, but since we have a team lunch, I'm not cooking. Wow. Honestly embarrassing that I am not cooking at all. The thing is, I brought lunches to the office when I was working, but I just didn't film that because I literally just brought like soup and English muffins and like stuff that I can just make there. So I didn't buy every single meal of the week, but I'm not proud of this. This is just what happens when you go into the office. You usually like have lunch or or like have dinner with people. So whatever, I'm just gonna start my work day. I'll talk to you guys soon. Happy Friday, yay.
been doing all, I'm, I put you guys in my pantry also. <laughs> but I've just not been doing all standing today. Maybe I need to stand for the rest of the day. Oh my God. I am like so energized. Also, I'm having a really productive day because I have a lot of meetings today. And so what I'm realizing and the conclusions that I'm making today, I've decided that on the days that I don't really have many meetings and like just really have like work to do and work to get done, I will probably go into the office on those days. But on like really heavy meeting days is when I can work from home, I think. So I can't like procrastinate or feel bored or lonely or anything if I have meetings. And it's not like you really want to take meetings in your office anyways, if you have the option at least. So, so that's the conclusion I'm making right now. I'm trying to like, I'm just trying to like move. Also, Thomas and I are going to Incheon VA again for dinner. He took me on my birthday. If you guys watched my birthday vlog, I have some footage of it the first time we went. But it was so sweet of him to do that. I want to treat him to the same place this time. And they're having this whole like special dinner and stuff today, like partnering with another chef so I'm gonna take him there today and take him to dinner because he's the best boyfriend ever and but I'm gonna make him buy me crumble cookies after <laughs> hi guys I am not going to the gym today what a freaking waste I'm like literally only disappointed in myself because I like wasted this outfit because I'm not going to the gym but it's fine I ended up actually having just a really long and really busy like revision heavy day and lots of meetings and stuff so <laughs> going to the gym at 10 didn't work going to the gym at 6 right now is not gonna work and I mean I was literally so upset to Thomas over the phone but it's okay I can actually work out tomorrow morning before the wedding get a good workout in then and be in like a better headspace I just like feel sad because I wasted this really cute workout outfit it's fine but it's okay whatever i i vented about it it's over i'm over it thomas is gonna be here literally any second and then we're gonna go to the mall we're gonna go to dinner and and yeah wait happy weekend <laughs> i want to do a whole realistic like we work week in my life health and fitness related because this is really like as this is just what happens all the time like i'll push off working out because it's really hard to actually do that during my work day and then and then like a lot of times I feel like this and maybe you guys can relate to just being like disappointed when life gets in the way and you can't do your exercise or movement that you wanted to. It's just like exercise and movement is just the easiest thing to be like, nope, not going to do that anymore. Part of me wants to say like that's okay, but I'd be lying if I said that's like how I 100% feel. Part of me does feel disappointed, but it's fine. I just need my boyfriend here <laughs> and everything will be fine. But let's change, get ready for dinner, go to the mall. And yeah, at least it's the weekend. Happy weekend. My work week was great. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Yeah. I need to get changed really quickly. Starting on a new page feels better every time. Flip a simple waking up next to you. It's gonna be a minute. Hey guys, we're gonna go to the mall quickly before dinner, but I want to show you guys my outfit. This outfit is so cute, isn't it? Okay. This sweater is from H&M. I got this last year. I just put my hair in like a low pony, left out my curtain bangs, and then put on some hoop earrings. These are from Majuri. All of my rings are from Ana Luisa. So cute. And then these are my birthday pants. This is part of a set from Princess Polly, but I'm just wearing the pants. And I'm wearing my white Converse to kind of make them a little bit more casual. But I think overall, this is a really cute, like casual, formal dinner look because we're going to a good dinner tonight. I feel a lot better now that I talk to you guys about like the whole workout situation. And now I'm just, I'm gonna enjoy the weekend. So, but if I don't talk to you guys after, I love you guys so much. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me on my work week. This was a really chill week and I feel like it was honestly a little boring, but I just went into the office a lot and didn't really cook, but it's okay. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. I post new videos every Monday and Thursday. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video, but until then... I miss you already. <laughs>
misunderstood.